Fire signs, Leo, Aries, and Sagittarius, welcome to my channel. My name is Chelsea. Thank you so much for liking and subscribing. I really appreciate your love and support. In this reading, we are going to find out who is thinking heavily about you right now and why. Today is the 3rd of December, 2.38 p.m. Bali Indonesian time. And this is a collective reading for fire signs. If you were divinely guided to watch this video, this message is meant for you, even if you're dealing with the same fire sign. Let's get your reading started. Spirits and angels, please show me who's thinking heavily about fire signs right now and why. The Empress at the bottom of the deck. This is a mother card, the Empress. So for some of you, your mother could be thinking heavily about you right now, okay? Um, I feel like the Empress, out of concern, how are you doing at work? How are you? Like with the King of Cups here, your emotions how are you feeling and you know pentacles again maybe they're worried about something about that may have something to do with your work or your emotions here with the king of cups this for some of you whether your mo mother is still alive or not you know i feel like yeah for a lot of you your mom could be worried about you just thinking about you a lot um I would, really, re I would really like to speak with you, Eight of Wands here. I would like to find out more about what's going on with you, with the high persistent here in my first. All right, but the Empress also can indicate this person could be a Virgo Capcom Taurus, somebody that you may see, or this person may see you as a lifetime partner, okay? Two of Wands indicates uh, indecision, and we've got the Five of Wands in Mavis and the Nine of Pentacles. So there's someone here who could be thinking heavily about you right now because maybe recently, or I mean in the past, there could be um, some sort of disagreement, some conflict, or that this person is just feeling really conflicted, okay? Either about something that they've said to you, or in regards of a decision that they would like to make, in regards to you, this person could be a Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus, could be a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, could be any sign, fire I'm seeing here. Um, this person feels kind of conflicted in regards to something that they want to say to you with the Eight of Wands and the First. Four of Wands and Mavis feels like something is rocky between the two of you, whether it's a separation or it's just things aren't going too well between the two of you. So this person could be thinking heavily in regards of making peace with you through, through the pentacles or coming to an agreement with you, speak with you, meet in the middle, compromise. The high priestess here in my verse can indicate this person could be thinking heavily in regards of opening up communication with you or opening up more to you, okay? So I'm going to cop to you in my verse. This person feels very overwhelmed emotionally in regards to you. This person does have feelings for you. Mm -hmm. Someone at work could also be thinking heavily about you right now. It may be related to work in general, okay? Let's see more. Seven of Swords. This person could be planning about something, okay? Planning about, again, how to speak with you, but this could also be someone, fire signs... Mm, honestly, <laughs> I'm not sure because the Seven of Swords and the Nine of Swords feels like there's a bit of an angry energy, upset. Someone may be upset with the other person for being kind of sneaky or upset that this person is running away from the issues. And not, I say, when I say someone, that means it could be you or the other person, okay? That means I'm not 100% sure whether it's you or the other person. So just take what resonates with you. And we've got the chariot here. Maybe this is someone that you met overseas. This chariot can indicate transportation. 
Well, this person could be thinking heavily in regards of traveling towards you. Well, no matter how long the travel is, okay, it can be, it can be five minutes for all I know, but and it could be 10 hours for all I know. <laughs> but uh, in general, fire signs, three swords, here, movers, this could be somebody who would like to heal the connection with you, right? The justice, I feel like they're in the midst of making a decision right now. Or well, this person may have made a certain decision that could have infuriated you, or you could have made a decision that may have infuriated them. But they've been looking at your pictures with embers here, looking at the conversations, could be text messages, and they've been thinking heavily in regards of making, doing something about this, solving some issues that both of you could be facing, facing right now. Hmm. Death here is in reverse. This person could be thinking heavily in regards of reviving this connection or not wanting this connection to end permanently. I'm going to pull out a few of these oracles. Sorry, I'm still sick, so I still sound bad. Now, I was just telling this to Earth Signs. I got one comment today. I think it, it was today, this morning. And he said, When are you ever not sick? <laughs> Come to think about it, you know, I've been sick ever since. <laughs> one second. I've been sick ever since I came to Bali, actually. I've been in Bali for like four months already, but m maybe I got COVID, maybe I got it a few times, I don't know, but, you know, and I've been super, super busy, and I've been going back and forth between Bali, Kuala Lumpur, and I was also in, if you guys were following my vlogs, I was in Paris, I was in London, I was traveling a lot while all of these COVID things going on, so I could be sick because of that, <laughs> but anyway. Um, let's continue with your reading, fire signs. I look for you everywhere. So this person is, um, maybe there's certain things that reminded you, reminded them of you, places that they've been to, or could be anything, okay? So they could be thinking heavily about you because of that, and we'll be together again. So this for me indicates them um, thinking heavily in regards of if both of you are going to see each other again, right? Most likely both of you are not together right now, or separated, or could be physically separated right now. I want to tell you how I feel. This person really actually wants to tell you how they feel. But I, I don't think they really want to, they want to tell you, but I don't think they're going to. At least not right now, because the King of Cups here is a king who's you know, suppressing their, his or her feelings, doesn't matter king or queen, it's not gender specific. I remember every detail of the day, they could be reminiscing about the first time both of you have met, when the first time both of you met each other, all the details, I hide between, behind material things, well it could be material things or things that are important to them where they could be setting their priorities, they, they could be putting these things first, right, one second. <coughs> Sorry. <laughs> Just being near you is intoxicating. So this person may have feelings for you, right? I feel like they could have been thinking about their feelings towards you. How maybe it could be a little bit overwhelming. Something that I feel they really would like, wouldn't really want you to know. Yeah, I'm afraid to contact you, so they don't really want to reach out to you. There are so many reasons. I feel like it could be because... Um, I feel like it's for a myriad of reasons, right? I feel like they don't really want to maybe get their heart broken because of the three swords here and rough first. All right, Fire Signs, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius, this is your reading. Hope you resonated in some way, shape, or form. I'm going to leave you with two playlists on the screen right now. The first one is from my second channel. It's a travel vlog channel. Check it out if you want to. And the second playlist is from this channel. It has all of the readings that I've done for you and for the rest of the signs with different topics and different questions. But these readings are still new because I post them every single day. All right, um, take care for your signs. I hope to see you back here again tomorrow. Bye.